So somebody tipped me off that there's Ultra Boost over at the Gloucester Outlets here um, over in Jersey. Um, we did just stop at the outlets the other day on the way to Marshalls and Ross for that vlog. But we didn't get to go in Adidas because of the torrential downpour that started. So we kind of bounced early. But a friend of mine did tip me off that there are some Ultra Boosts sitting over there. So I'm going to go uh, get a peek at these Warlocks myself. My age is at a doctor's appointment, so I'm riding solo today. Um, it's been a good, fruitful morning so far. Um, we got her, the Jaclyn Hill uh, Morphe palette that dropped this morning. at a, It dropped 11 a.m. Eastern Time. And then we got her to Kim Kardashian West Beauty tour kit that came out today at 12 Eastern. So we're two for two on drops for today. And then at 316, the Uncivilized Stone Cold Steve Austin t-shirt drops. Hopefully we can make it three for three when Foamy drops them. And uh, if not, when you hear the glass, it's your ass. Because that's the bottom line. Because Stone Cold said so. <laughs> Let's, I'm going to run into this Adidas store, see if uh, the word on the street is accurate. They, they do have Ultra Boost here. Um, after that, I got to do some other running around. I'm going to hit the Pack Sun outlet here. It's my boy Ray's birthday, so shout out to him. Happy birthday, Ray. I'm going to grab an outfit for uh, his birthday tonight. Um, we're going to Drake night at the Fillmore here in Philly. After that, I got to run to the Apple store and hopefully get the bat phone replaced. Um, I can't make calls unless it's on speakerphone and it's not holding a charge for shit. So I'm gonna go to Apple and hopefully get them to take care of that. But I am gonna switch over to the iPhone now for when we go in the Adidas store. So I'll be right back with you. See if they do have some ultra boost here. Got some olive, olive tubular X's, some black and white tubular X's, some shell tones, some stained seeds. some stained smith bond nets. They do got some Ultra Boost STs. Some Pure Boost. Another Pure Boost. Some Ultra Boost STs, full size run here, $129. So in a boost section. So Ultra Boost wasn't really here it was Ultra Boost STs and some Energy Boost. These Stan Smith Prime that's for $49.99 and my size. I'm gonna have to grab these. Yeah, these are definitely a must cop for me. So I'm gonna go grab it, get in line guys. I'm gonna grab these uh grab these Stan Smiths and uh, I'll check you back out the car. I actually changed my mind and didn't get the Stan Smiths. Um I have this problem as most sneakerheads do, which is buying sneakers, buying sneakers, buying sneakers, buying sneakers. Buying sneakers. And I'm trying to limit to what I buy. And a big problem with these sneakers on sale is, oh, it's only $50 here, it's $50 there. But then you just buy and buy and buy. And then next thing you know, you bought three, $400 worth of, three to $400 worth of sneakers on sale, which you really didn't want or need. And you could have put that money to get in a more expensive pair of sneakers that you did actually want or need. So I put them back. Um, they're constantly on sale over here. I, I come to these outlets a lot. I was a little disappointed 
that I didn't see in uh, Adidas Ultra Boost there. They did have the Ultra Boost ST, which I hear are just as comfortable, especially if you have a wide foot. I didn't really dig the the navy blue and like lime green colorway, so I, I you know I decided not to pull the trigger and get them either. They had some of the Energy Boost there. The Royal Blue colorway was actually really cool. I kind of you know thought about pulling the trigger on them for only a hundred dollars, but the uh, the black pair. I actually really, really like, but I have way too many black sneakers, so again, I had advised myself against getting them, but I did go to PacSun and get a fit for Ray's birthday tonight, grab my Asia pair of white jeans from the guest outlet. Um, so next move is I'm going to the Apple store, and then after the Apple store, hopefully my phone gets fixed, and then after that, I have to go to FedEx to pick up two pair of sneakers that were shipped attempted delivery twice which FedEx is bullshitting me I was home today when these were there you didn't knock you just put that tag on my door that's some bullshit but there were two there were two pair of sneakers that I coincidentally bought on sale from the end two sneakers I've been keeping my eye on knowing they weren't going to sell out and knowing the price was eventually going to dip and I was able to get them on that end clearance sale they had for the summer um, this is where we're going to part ways for now I'm not going to take these guys to the Apple store with me I will check back in when I am at FedEx, making sure the packages were required. And then I have to pick up my Asia and take her to Ulta. So I got a little bit of a busy schedule. She's gonna hit Ulta while I'm at the Apple store. So maybe my Asia will be back with an appearance, maybe not, but I'll definitely be back in a few minutes at the FedEx pickup. Peace. She's here. I decided to check out this Nordstrom rack and look what they got here Y3 Boost $199.97. Even at Nordstrom rack, that's crazy. These are so crazy, though. The boost on these is insane. They got some dope new balances. And Smiths, some Nike, some Nike SBs, these dunks too, these dunks are sick. Hey guys, well, uh, this part of the video was unintended, Niasia ran an Ulta over here in Cherry Hill, so I popped into their Nordstrom rack, and I can't believe the heat that I seen in there, to see a Y3 sitting uh, in Nordstrom Rack was crazy to me. The price, I mean, it wasn't really that big of a discount. It was still $199 for the sneakers, but they had a lot of heat as far as New Balance, um, some dope basics, uh, you know, the usual suspects you see in places like this, KDs. Um, but I was surprised by the Dunks and the Y3s the most, I think. Um, new Balances and stuff like that tend to end up in stores like this because you know, they don't sell at Nordstrom, so they push them here. But a couple of them colorways of them new bounces were really, really dope. Um, I'm actually surprised I didn't go back and get a pair. But we're off to FedEx to get my package from the end. Peace. Well, I just got the FedEx. Target was acquired. Package was retrieved. Are you unboxing? No, I'm not unboxing right now. That's it for today, guys. We're going to get out of here. We're going to Drake Night for my boy Ray's birthday. I'll be back tomorrow with a double unboxing. And until next time, I'm Richie Ruckus. Peace.